It's Elizabeth from Try Again Shop, and I am super excited to show you what I got today. Lord help me. Let's go thrifting. Hello world. So Italy has some of the best vintage markets um, ever. And you only have to wake up like a quarter past the best crap dawn to beat the little grandmas to the goods. Honestly, I may have taken too long to sit naked and eat my granola bar this morning. Um, so I'm running late, but I made it. Okay, calm down, Rome. Like, we get it. Welcome to heaven. I beat the tourists out. <laughs> now I can dig. All right, America. Next. Okay, this lettuce and crop of a tag slaughter. Insane. So cute. Okay, this is not English. Wow, we love a Seinfeld original. <laughs> That's what they call me. Eh. A guy behind me just said, fuck Americans. Um, I'm still going with only two euros in my pocket because I'm insane. Grazie. And that was essentially the extent of my Italian and the extent of your lesson. You're welcome. I'm the sauce. I'm so happy, please. You have to take a break. Oh my god, this is Non sa poco che altro tira la pastella, la sera fredda. Quando rimettete nell'orno si riscalda e rilascia la pastella. We have reached the end. Poor. So that was a successful market trip, I'd say. Aside from me spending 50 cents on batteries, but that's a problem that me and my electronics will have to deal with. Now I'm gonna go home and try on all my stuff. I just ran to the bus and then it disappeared, which may be the first sentence on Rome's wiki page. Finally home with the giddies. And I'm starving. This is also now a culinary tutorial. Okay, you. Okay, I'm here with my haul. Oh, oh, oh. Thanks for sticking around this long, even though I have um, 0 0.04 megapixel quality on this. Super high. Okay, let's look at what we got. Today was a really good day. I actually got a lot of goodies. We have these denim shorts by General Company, which sounds like a joke, but that's actually what they're called. General Company. Um, super cute light wash high-waisted. I kind of dig the baggy Bermuda look, but they're gonna get cropped. Ah. Lots of little tanky tank tank tops. This cute little tank top by Reds has a little bedazzled logo. I love um, when all the gems are there still. So this one is in tip-top shape. Okay, this little crochet guy is too freaking cute. 90s does 70s vibes, but um, love the sunflower, what? Love a crochet. Brown wool cami, super cute, very Italian looking. I kinda really dig the 
the straps in two different colors and I'm pretty sure it was an intentional and not just a makeshift by a little Italian grandma but super cute cute little mismatch this little turtleneck is cute because it has super side slits okay hi that's sexy yeah and cropped fit too we love that all right this little corset off the shoulder sweater magic is incredible i'm obsessed with the rib and the corset detail down the front with the hook and eyes two dang cute and this guy i think was like one euro okay shut up that's insane that's beautiful We've got this turtleneck too. I'm like crazy for turtlenecks right now and it's spring, so that should be over, but it's not. Love the lettuce hem on the neck of this guy. And I love a super long turtleneck that covers my entire face because sometimes you need to cover your entire face. Um, but I think I'm gonna probably crop this guy super short and do some kind of um, stitch detail at the hem too close it up and I paired it with this little nighty. I'm um, classically known as a master of making nighties unsexy. So that's cute layered. It's also so cute on its own but like who needs to wear it on its own? <laughs> Another classic making a nighty, not cute. This little cherry number. Super cute over like a baggy graphic tee. Like this one, that's probably gonna also get a super crop. Old Italian industry. More things to get cropped include this cute sweater, kind of sporty. <laughs> Wool blend, but I like the color blocking, but it's definitely gonna get a crop. Maybe I'll do some other updates to it. But crop first. Also on the chopping block is uh, this sweater in like the cutest color ever. Yeah, that's gonna get a crop too. But super digging this like mock turtleneck and the stretchy rib. Super cozy. Ooh, it has fleece lining too. <laughs> Cropped with like high-waisted denim. So that goes with our little uh, Barney and Friends look with this wool slip dress purple and green baby yeah we stand barney and friends this cute little graphic tee doesn't have any tags i don't know what the company is but um i think that print is super cute whatever the logo is and that will probably also get a crop <laughs> yeah that will look cute super cropped with the raw hem I paired that with this cute little skirt that has this kind of frayed lace detail. But yeah, that sexy little cutie. This is the puffy shirt, literally, from Seinfeld. This is vintage 70s actually, so not from Seinfeld. I love that little cha-cha guy. Cha-cha, real smooth. Do, 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 do. And that looks cute with like a denim skirt. Like this freaking Dolce & Gabbana one. Like, can you believe that? Insane. This is like six sizes too big for me, but I had to get it anyway because I'm addicted to it. You can't say no to Dolce & Gabbana when it's so cheap at the market. Hi, we're in Italy, okay. And then we've got these vintage diesel jeans. How Y2K is this bedazzled button and the name tape waistband and at the ankles, so funny, so cute. Super Y2K little baby doll. And the capri length, pair this with a little baby tank it doesn't get more y2k than that got another little glitzy guy so 
of my little sparklies today. Little tees tucked into jeans or tied at the front. Shimmer, shimmer. And so many bedazzles today. Um, hi, I don't know who Danny is, but you're welcome. So this is by Colors of Benetton, which obviously there's so much of at the market here because Italy. Um, but yeah, Danny, hit me up. <laughs> I got your tea. Another little cute tanky tank. This one's like in a pretty sharp mousse color. And knit. We love knit. We love the color. On that little knit guy. It has a cute knit pattern. <laughs> this is another really cute knit. Like our cute ribbed um, cardigan. That's super stretchy but also pretty tight. So has a cute fit. Little tiny mother pro buttons. Precious. This is some vintage 90s gold. Okay, who doesn't? Love a moo moo. <laughs> so comfy. Italian grandmas have got the style. All the moo moos here have super cute prints. This one looks really cute, just like with a grommet belt, but I don't know if I'll edit it or do something to it to revamp. It has pockets and these little gold buttons down the front. Adorable, spiced up with a grommet belt or a cute little sweater. The sweater is by Mano Boni, made in Italy, of course, and has the stinking tag still on it. Ew. Crap little guy from the 90s, love a lettuce hem. At the hem and at the hem of the sleeves. Too dang cute. Such a tiny little crop. Hi. Hello. Adorable. Okay, my f probably my favorite piece of the day is this crazy sheer mesh rave top that has a print of these people i don't know if they're making out but hot cool <laughs> i love the ruching on the sleeves and the side seams this is a cutie patootie little gem and love that pair with these like lemon yellow industrial pants that have all of these zippers and seams and pulls these are super cool. And it's got snaps all over and all these pockets. So many pockets. I'm in love. These are by a brand called Time Zone. Love these. The fabric is nice. The color is super soft and pretty. I also got some rando fabrics that I'm kind of obsessed with. Ooh, ooh. Italian flag. Grazie. This was one euro, but I can use it for so many things. I can cut it up and probably use it for patches and stuff. It's got a cute little trophy. Ooh. This is insane. This panda pillowcase. I was like, I kind of want to keep it just as a pillowcase to put on my bed, but how cute will this be as a little top? Boo, boo, boo. So cute. Do a little... Panda bando, a panda. I also got this like uh, Italian dish towel. Uh -huh. But look at the print, it's so cute with the little pinstripes and the fruities. This is definitely from the 60s or the 70s. And that'll be cute as a little top too, maybe. You like that? That's everything. Can you believe it? And it's only been <laughs> six hours. All of this stuff's gonna be on Depop soon or it's going to be reworked and on Depop in a little bit longer because sewing is hard. Um, so if you like that, let me know because if you didn't like it, I promise I will never ever do it again because it was terrible and embarrassing. And our Depop shop is always open at depop.com slash tryagainshop or on Instagram at tryagain underscore shop. Thanks guys.